Okay, so I'm back. And so the good news is all of my hair has reverted to the way that it was. Um, the curls, I washed them out. They they came right back. I will say this though, when I was washing it and detangling in the shower, it was a lot easier um, to get through. And I did use the other products that came with the, I did use the other products that came with the keratin, uh, organics keratin, um, let me push this back a little bit, uh, the organics keratin line. So I used the sulfate free shampoo and the conditioner. The conditioner smelled really good. Um, and I liked it. It did make my hair pretty soft. I don't really see too much of a difference in my in my hair um, maybe a little bit in the front and then the top but the top part of my hair is always a little bit softer than the middle this is I don't know if you can see my texture here but it's definitely good old-fashioned faux be fuzzy but it did it did make it easier to detangle and get through it was it's really soft it's really soft right now um, so as far as manageability is concerned, um, I think it did help maybe a little bit because I, when I detangled, I didn't really have any hair to comb out or anything like that. It came right, every, the, the comb like went like right through and it was, it was really good. So I can't really complain about, about that with the manageability, but as you can see, tons and tons of shrinkage is just so ridiculous but it did make it really soft and it was easy to get the comb through i used my good wide tooth shower comb and it kind of just slid through usually that's a much more involved process because my hair is so thick and there's just so much of it but overall this wasn't too too bad um i don't still don't think i'm going to re flat iron it i'm just not in the mood it's late i probably will blow dry it and see if it blow dries better but i probably won't um flat iron it again at least not right now number one it's late and i just don't feel like it number two the way it looks and the way it's going right now i just don't think that it really did all that much to make my hair any straighter or go flat or anything like that. So maybe I'll see a difference when I blow dry again, but as of right now, I'm not, I'm not really feeling like I'm probably just not going to um, re-flat iron, but I think I will blow dry one more time on very, very low heat, probably cool heat, because I do have the cool shot on mine. So I'll probably use very low heat and just stretch it out a little bit so I won't go to bed with um, a wet head. And then I'll probably just do my twist and see what it does on the stretched hair. And I'll see if maybe it, there is a difference in how long it stays stretched because even like when I work out and I do pre-stretch my hair, it still shrinks up extremely quick. So I'm gonna see if maybe the blow dry will hold out a little bit longer this go around. So, Hopefully this helps you guys. Um, maybe you guys will have really good results. I might come back and give you a little sneak peek after I do my blow dry. I think I'm going to do a blow dry and then a Bantu knot on the blow dry, sleep on it, and do a big fluff. So we'll see how that goes. So I'll see you guys probably in the morning with my fluff. Bye.